right, so who is Charlie's rugby idol? Uh, Kane Healy, Johnny Stewart, Paul O'Connell. I'm going to go with A, Kane Healy. Same position, I suppose. Same province, so seems reasonable enough. I said Kane Healy. Kane Healy, obviously the obvious choice, him being a prop. But uh, lo and behold, even though Paul O'Connell is there, it actually is Johnny Stewart. <laughs> He's just something else when he gets in the ball, like. When he looks into your eyes as well, it's just a magical <laughs> moment. Yeah, he's just a really motivational man and he gets me going. Uh, second one was, what chat-up line would Charlie use to get a date? So A was, how much does the polar bear weigh? Pause, <laughs> enough to break the ice. <laughs> B, can I have your picture so I can show Santa what I want for Christmas? <laughs> and C, is there a science room nearby or am I just se sensing the chemistry between us? Probably B, probably B, it was quite funny and he's a funny guy, so we'll go with B. <laughs> Is there a science room nearby? Or am I just seeing the chemistry between us? Would have to be the main one, because I'm quite an intelligent man, being all scientific and stuff. What, what are you studying? I'm um, studying the, uh, do you know the thing with the, in the college? It's oh, that one? Yeah, that one. Yeah, yeah. Cool yeah. <laughs> what is Charlie's favourite pastime? Singing, gym and online gaming. Oh, he's a good singer, like, so we'll go with A, singing. I have been called the songbird of my generation. <laughs> Believe it or not, it's actually online gaming. I am into massive online gaming, multiplayer. Uh, have the headset and all, huge, Any, uh, huge fan of Skyrim. Skyrim, yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. get to fly around on dragons and stuff, it's pretty awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Who was Rob's favourite player growing up? A, Brian O'Driscoll. B, Dan Carter. And C, Benji Marshall. He's kind of real flashy and stuff. Um, so I'm going to have to go with C, Benji Marshall, him being the more flashy flashy player, being in rugby league, of course. Uh, I went with um, Benji Marshall because, you know, you've got really like, slick hair, so I, I, you come across quite a slick person. Yeah, I will say, yeah. Yeah? yeah? I like a good sidestep. I'm the, sort of the sidestep king, so... I was flashy flashy again, yeah. flashy again. Yeah. What is Rob's favourite pastime? A, colouring, colouring in at his nans. B, farming. C, Golf. <laughs> Colouring at his nans, like you'd probably, he, he comes across as quite a simple guy, so you'd think that he probably would have a few colouring book collections. Farming, up in Belfast, not the greatest topography up there, or the most fertile soils. I'm gonna go with farming, just because, um, just because who he is as a person, really, he just comes across as quite of a, quite of a farmer. You kind of possess the traits of a farmer, which which are like being real cool and slick and, and <laughs> Do you just know a lot of girls like a farmer. Banter with the lads, like yeah, farming was right. I was right. Yeah, yeah. No, just growing up in a farm, so it's just what I've always enjoyed down. So it's nice to take my head out of rugby. Where would Rob take a girl on the first date? A dinner, B cinema, C mini golf. A dinner would seem the most likely. Because everything it is, just a first date, cinema, that's just too much for me. In my case, I'd have to get a small popcorn just to come across as quite a slim character. Uh, Rob can get the large, he can, he, can do, he can do whatever he wants in that situation. I'll go a dinner, and I think he'd probably go for a cheeky Nando's, just seems kind of cool like that. Like, I wouldn't be able to do that, like, probably go to McDonald's or something. Being it was the first day I went for a dinner. It's the only one that got it wrong, it's actually, oh. actually B, it's cinema. It's cinema, yeah. yeah. Uh, I got two out of three, so it's much, much better than so. You don't know me at all. No, no I don't. <laughs>